Ichiro Fujisaki from Tokyo. Uh, thank you very much for uh, this occasion. Uh, Japan has been attacked uh, so much, uh, the government and the enterprises, in the last few years. So we are stepping up uh, our defense, and in 2013, new strategy. Uh, last year, basic law, and this year, uh, from January, uh, cabinet has uh, established a, a national center for c cyber. And in May this year, we have uh, agreed with the United States new defense guideline, and uh, in that, cyber and security is a very important field of cooperation between Japan and the United States. Now, we are facing new challenges now. One, from Je uh, January 2016, we are introducing something like your social security number. And uh, people, some people are concerned that uh, the personal information would leak out because only this May, our pension service was attacked and uh, 1.25 million names were leaked out and numbers. So uh, there are, this is a big challenge we have to face. Now, the next challenge is 2020. We have Olympic Games, we are hosting it. And we know what ha happened to London. There was huge, number of attacks uh, during that Olympic game, so we have to really create a system because we have uh, all those airlines and uh, bullet trains and everything there, so we have to really uh, create uh, good uh, defense for that. This is the uh, uh, where we are. Now, uh, we are very interested in uh, the discussion between uh, two presidents, President Obama and President Xi, and uh, maritime security and cyber. Uh, but uh, personally, I don't have too much euphorism, uh, optimism, uh, uh, because uh, I think uh, two years ago, uh, US and China established a working group but, uh, on cyber security. And I don't think there has been any tangible results because that's very clear. Uh, it's very different from uh, any arms reduction discussion uh, like which existed between Soviet Union and United States because two sides, both sides are saying that they are the victims and no one is saying that uh, uh, they are, had, are uh, on the offensive side. So everyone is saying that uh, we have to be very careful, we are the victims and the second point is that uh, both sides have to conceal their capability as well. Uh, so. Uh, uh, how much uh, discussion they can really uh, have uh, uh, is uh, very limited in that sense, I think. Now, Code of uh, Ethics, uh, I think it's a very good trial. Uh, it's a very interesting idea, but uh, uh, we have to be very careful uh, going step by step because, uh, as I said, everyone is saying that uh, they are not the offensive, so uh, that's the very difficult part about this uh, Code of Ethics as well. There's an old saying in China. Uh, the word contradiction in Chinese is shield and spear. Because uh, one merchant came to town and said, this shield is the strongest shield in the world. No spear can go through. And he was, at, on the other hand, selling a spear. And he said, this spear can go through any shield. So people asked him, what if you use the shield and try to go through that spear? And he, of course, he can answer. So the Chinese con word contradiction is this shield and spear. And at, we have been doing this uh, shield and spear all the way in our arms race. And uh, I think this is an eternal competition. And I think this is going to happen in cyber area as well because once we started to use internet, web, uh, big data, we cannot go without it. It's like electricity. Once we started to use it, even if there's any problem, we have to be using it, defending. So, and the, there are always someone who's going to exploit that situation and try to attack us. So we have to 
make better shield, better, and that eternal competition is going on, starting. So, very frankly, uh, this trial is very important, that ethics, and I think we should uh, involve ourselves in that, but at the same time, we have to be uh, very cognizant of the fact that uh, cyber peace will not really be there, and we have to be dependent on those code of ethics amongst like-minded people, like-minded countries, but that is not universal. Uh, I'm sorry, uh, uh, I think we should put this uh, discussion in uh, a realistic terms, so I uh, made a little maybe uh, challenging position to uh, some of you, but thank you very much.